video is sponsored by Surfshark. We very, very rarely do well down at Southampton. I've been to St. Mary's a couple of times and it's not just been bad most times, it's been absolutely horrific. From Dean Smith's last game in charge of Aston Villa, the fifth loss in a row. The Pepe Reina incident in that all yellow kit where he ran the whole length of the pitch chasing, I think it was Stuart Armstrong, after we didn't score from the corner, we ended up losing 2-0. That was an awful afternoon. And that's not even mentioning the 6-1 defeat we had down there back in 2015, where Sadio Mane scored the quickest hat-trick in Premier League history in less than three minutes. Horrendous. Southampton currently find themselves bottom of the Premier League, however, they have won their last three games, each in a different competition, including a massive, massive win against Man City in the League Cup, where that night they were fantastic. It's not a great omen facing sides who are bottom of the Premier League. Villa have done it twice already this season. West Ham at home, they were bottom of the league, failed to win. Forest away, they were bottom of the league at the start of that game, and we failed to win that as well. So it's not a great omen going into this one. Obviously, it's a huge game to keep up our momentum as well. Really big victory against Leeds last week, and obviously, we've got to keep up with those teams like Chelsea. Chelsea and Liverpool, which feels mental to say. It's been a really interesting week actually at Villa. John Duran coming in from Chicago Fire out of absolutely nowhere. Danny Ings leaving as well for West Ham for 15 million quid. Very interesting bit of business from Villa. So let us know what you're thinking about that down in the comments. We'll probably talk a little bit more about all the transfer stuff over on the Villa on Tour podcast, which you can find on Apple, Spotify as well. So go and give it a listen. Have some really good feedback on the podcast so far. Use it on your commute to work, school, college. Go and give it a listen. Let us know what you're thinking on it. So let's sort out this Southampton hoodoo. Let's go down there and pick up a massive three points up the Villa Boys. Uh, what's going on here, Gaffer? Just arrived in Southampton. And we're spreading the joy. And spreading the joy and dishing out the cakes. Oh, no. Here we are then, birthday boy, here Southampton away. Um, last year, your birthday weekend was Everton away and we won. I know, it's We're great. going again, we're winning today, what are we thinking? 100%, 100%, oh, well. 100 winning today. Um, I think, you know, just a bit more confidence, you know, everywhere we go now, I think under Emery, we are just a bit more confident, which is great. Um, I think we'll win today. Probably yeah. go, I'll go 2-1 today, usually Ooh. the free one, usually the free one, but I reckon Leon Bailey will pop up today with a couple. Come on. But just before we crack on to St. Mary's, just a quick message from the video sponsors. Yes, so this video is very kindly sponsored by the wonderful people over at Surfshark VPN. Surfshark is a virtual private network that keeps you safe and secure whilst you're using the internet, and in particular, those public Wi-Fis. Public Wi-Fis aren't very well encrypted, if encrypted at all, so Surfshark will stop those nasty hackers seeing what you do and seeing all your passwords and everything that you keep on this device. As well as keeping you safe, Surfshark opens you up to so much more content online. In just a few seconds, you can change the location of your device to anywhere across the world, which opens up so many more Netflix libraries, so there's so much more stuff to watch. So for example, those people outside of the UK, or if you're going on holiday or whatever, you can change the location of your device back to the UK, making it easier to watch things like BBC iPlayer, ITV Hub, and of course, Match of the Day on BBC iPlayer. So you can watch all the Villa victories on Match of the Day, wherever you are across the world. Surfshark are also the only VPN to offer the use of one account across an unlimited number of devices. So if you want access to so much more stuff online, whilst also staying anonymous, private and safe, I've got a deal for you. Use the top link in the description, use that code Villa on tour to get yourself a massive 83% off and an extra three months for free as well. What a deal that is. And Surfshark also offers a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's absolutely no risk involved. If you're not a fan, you can just get your money back. <laughs> oh, that's my <laughs> Max, followed you for years, pal, and I reckon today's the first time because I've seen you. Yeah. We're going to go 2-0 Villa. 2-0 Villa? 2-0 Villa. Villa. Andy, what are we yeah, saying, mate? I'd say I'll probably a little bit closer to 1-0 Villa. 1-0? So Three points, so we need that. Just doesn't matter. Up the Villa, boys. Up the Villa. Right, Chopper. Up the Villa. Come on, the boys. Yeah. Oh. 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 Oh
and uh, hope we can nick it. Though these don't score a lot of goals, but hope we can nick it. Two one, Villa. Come on. Right, Josh Carter. We'll start with you, Josh. Score prediction, mate. Uh, two one, Villa. I think Bailey will score two. Bailey, brace. What are we saying, Carter? Three one, Bailey two. Oh, give us some of the Villa boys. Villa home. Oh, Villa. Villa.
I'll keep this brief, but I absolutely love, love away wins like that. I really do. Like the classic gritty 1-0 away win. I don't think Southampton were great. I think they're they're a poor side. They'll struggle this season. But then again, I don't think we were great either. Similar to the sort of Leeds game last week. I don't think we were brilliant by any stretch, but we have that grit and we have that nous that Unai Emery brings to get a huge 1-0 win and get the three points, which was massive today. I absolutely loved it. I loved it today. Really, really good. Great scenes when the goal went in. And uh, we'll discuss it more on the podcast. So stay tuned for that. Apple, Spotify, stay tuned for the podcast. We'll discuss it much more in depth on that. But I loved it today. Really, really good. It's nice to see us actually win at Southampton. Huge. Really, really happy with that today. Really am. Obviously, we don't play next week because we're out the FA Cup. Uh, but yeah, two weeks off now. Happy days. And then uh, Leicester, Man City. The Arsenal, so big games coming up, and I am buzzing for them. Go and download Sir Shark, leave a like on the video, comment your thoughts on the game, and I shall see you in a couple of weeks. We might do something next week. Stay tuned. All the best.